what was your motivation to continue like pushing through despite all of these no's, despite all of this victim blaming, despite all of these doors being shut in your face, what propelled you to keep going forward and fighting this thing? Well, I mean, as I said, I, I felt that it was a cause within a day or two. And so I realized that, you know, these other victims needed to be protected. The site needed to come down, that laws need to be put in place. And I've just always been a cause oriented person since I was a kid in Georgia. I was, you know, fighting against the upper class community who were really very, very racist. Mm -hmm. And my adoptive family was very racist. And so mm -hmm. I was called an end lover, like practically every day by mm -hmm. people who were supposed to be my friends or schoolmates. So, you know, I was always kind of fighting for causes and for fighting against prejudice has always been important to me. And, you know, prejudice, this is sexism is really what revenge yeah. porn is because it's mostly targeted at females. 